isang mapagpalang araw at magandang buhay po sa inyong lahat. Naritong muli ang inyong matinikatang musikero channel sa pangunguna ng inyong abang lingkod upang magbahaging muli ng kaalaman sa larangan ng matematika. Ang ating diskusyon sa session na ito ay napapatungkol sa special products, Cubop Binomial. At bilang panimula ng ating lesson, ito ngayon ang cube of binomial at ito ang ating mga given expression. The cube of x plus y is equal to x cube plus 3x square y plus 3xy square plus y cube. Pangalawa, the cube of x minus y is equal to x cube minus 3x square y plus 3xy square minus y cube. At siyempre, ito ngayon ang ating mga steps sa paghahanap ng cube of binomial para sa ating given na cube of x plus y. First step, we have to cube the first term x of the given binomial. Ang ating sagot, x cube. Sapagkat ang first term natin is x at ang cube nito is x cube. Para sa ating second step, Square the first term x and multiply it to the last term y. Ang ating output, x square y. For our third step, trace the term obtained from the second step. The term obtained from the second step is x square y. If we have to trace it, ang result natin is 3x square y. For our fourth step, square the last term y and multiply it to the first term x. The result is x y square. Para naman sa ating fifth step, trace the term obtained from the fourth step. We have it as three x y square. For our sixth step, cube the last term y of the given binomial x plus y. At ang cube nito is given as y cube. Ang cube ng y is equal to y cube. I repeat. For our seventh step. Add all the terms obtained from step 1, step 3, step 5, and step 6. At ang ating output, x cubed plus 3x square y plus 3xy square plus y cubed. Finally, ang special product natin para sa ating cube of binomial x plus y is equal to x cubed plus 3x square y plus 3xy square plus y cubed. Now, let us have our example number 1. Paano ba natin naanapin ang cube ng 2x plus 3y? At siyempre, ito ang ating solusyon. Sumunod lang tayo sa mga steps. Step 1, cube the first term 2x of the binomial. Ano nga ba ang cube ng 2x? Ang sagot, 8x cubed dahil lang 2 times 2 times 2 is equal to 8. At ang cube ng x is x cubed. That is why we have 8x cubed. For our second step, square the first term 2x and multiply it to the last term 3y. Kapag in-square ko ang 2x, equal yan sa 4x square. And then afterward, multiply natin ang 3y. Ang ating output, 12x square y. For our third step, trace the term obtained from the second step. If I have to trace 12x square y, our output is 36x square y. Ito naman ngayon ang ating fourth step. Square the last term 3y and multiply it to the last term. Square the last term 3y and multiply it to the first term, I mean 2x. Ang square ng last term na 3y is 9y square. And then afterward, i-multiply natin sa 2x ang ating output. 18xy square. For our fifth step, trace the term obtained from the fourth step. 18xy square to be multiplied by 3. I think our output is 54xy square. For our sixth step, cube the last term 3y of the given binomial. Ano nga ba ang cube ng 3y? Ang ibig sabihin ng cube of 3y is 3y times 3y times 3y, which is actually equal to 27y cube. And now, ito ang ating last step. Add all the terms obtained from step 1, step 3, step 5, and step 6. At ito ngayon ang ating output, ang ating final answer. 
8x cubed plus 36x square y plus 54xy square plus 27y cubed. Thus, ang cube lang 2x plus 3y is equal to 8x cubed plus 36x square y plus 54xy square plus 27y cubed. At siyempre, ito naman ngayon ang ating pangalawang halimbawa. Ano nga ba ang cube ng 3a minus 5b? First step, cube the first term 3a of the given binomial. Output, 27a cube. Because 3a times 3a times 3a is equal to 27a cube. Second step, score the first term 3a and multiply to the last term negative 5b. Ang score ng 3a is 9a square. At the same time, imumultiply natin ito ng negative 5b. Kaya ang ating output, negative 45a square b. Third step, trace the term obtained from the second step. Kapag ang negative 45a square b ay naimultiply natin sa 3, ang ating output, negative 135a square b. For fourth step, Score the last term, negative 5b, and multiply it to the first term, 3a. Ano kaya ang sagot natin dito? Ang ating output, 75ab square. Kapag in-square ko ang negative 5b, that is equal to 25b square. And then multiply it by 3a, we have 75ab square. For our fifth step, trace the term obtained from the fourth step. If I will multiply 75ab square to 3, our output is 225ab square. For our sixth step, cube the last term, negative 5b of the given binomial. Ano nga ba ang value ng negative 5b times negative 5b times negative 5b? Ang output natin, negative 125b cube. For our seventh step, Add all the terms obtained from step 1, step 3, step 5, and step 6. Ang output, 27a cubed minus 135a square b plus 225a b square minus 125b cubed. Thus, the cube of 3a minus 5b is equal to 27a cubed minus 135a square b a square B, I mean, ulitin ko na lang. The cube of 3A minus 5B is equal to 27A cube minus 135A square B plus 225A B square minus 125B cube because negative 5B times negative 5B times negative 5B is negative 125B cube. At yan ngayon ang ating final answer para sa cube ng ating binomial na 3a minus 5b. Thank you and God bless. Hanggang sa muli, ito po ang inyong matinik at ang musikero channel na nagsasabing maraming salamat po at mabuhay ang bawat kabataang Pilipino.